up, crew? Welcome to Leg Day. We are doing it. Getting our legs on. Get these guys going. Can he? Live. Going live. Checking connection. I'm live. And I'm live. What's up? Bam! Welcome to Thunderbird Leg Day. We're doing it. Getting our legs on. I'll show you some super cool stuff. Hold on. Woo! Crack pop. We're going to do a pretty cool, fast, and fun leg day. I'm going to show you how to blast your stems and uh, get your glutes going. A little hypertrophy work. We're going to begin today with some sumo uh, RDLs with bands around the hips. So this is just for a lot of gluten hamstring activation. Then we're going to go hammer your quads with some uh, what I'm going to call a sissy squat or heel elevated mummy squat. You'll see me doing it in the goblet hold with my feet on some plates. Just a lot of quads there. And then we're going to end with some single leg variations. And that will be our day. So we'll get a lot of volume in each. You see what I'm doing here is these RDLs because I'm just getting my hamstrings loose. I'm getting my back a little primed. And I'll get maybe about 50 of these guys a little bit deeper each time just to get nice and loose. And then we'll start having some fun. You know it. Muscle anarchy style. Bam. You know it. All right. Hold this out right here for a second. I'm just going to grab my band, so hold on one second. What are you guys doing? You make a couple of them here? You guys want to do butt step? Come on. Come do butt step with me. Doesn't want to do stuff. All right. Cool. So here's my band. It's a nice thick band. I was actually thinking that's probably not going to be enough resistance. So what I might do is take this to a dumbbell, and you'll see me. I'll just bring my 120 hand around. Oh, you son of a bitch. There we go. All right. So what I'll do with this is I'm going to string it through the dumbbell, and then it's going to go around my hips. So I'm stepping through the band with both of my legs. I'm gonna go up on the hip, I'm gonna take a couple steps forward, and this is gonna be banded resistance for that. Woo, oh yeah. That's pretty, that's not bad actually, that's pretty hard. Um, so we're gonna do that for four sets of 15 with a three count down to get our sumo RDL. So for the sumo stance, what you're going to do is like if you say, okay, regular stance is ready to about shoulder width. For sumo stance, I want you to go about a foot's width wider than you normally squat at, turn your toes out, and this will be your sumo stance. My bells are going to be right here. You could also do this holding one kettlebell or one super duper heavy dumbbell. It doesn't really make a huge difference. Um, I'll pull you guys back so you get a good view. Yes, sir. So let me get... Uh, good warm-up set here. I'm going to start light with uh, like my 35s, and I'll probably end up building up a little bit as I go, just to get my hand, my yammies loose. Moons over my hammies. Oh, here we go. I'm going to put these here so I can get the band first. It's a little tricky getting into that band. This stuff is also a nice, I like this variation for the lower back too, because the RDL doesn't make you go into like a compromised position like a full deadlift does. You might have to get all the way down to the floor. So the bell's right here between my legs. I'm just gonna go nice and slow. Two. 
two, three, four, five. Yep. All right. Yeah. Pretty pumpy on the hamstrings. Good. I'll take it. One set done. Now we're going to keep the rep scheme the same. So we're still going to go four by 15, but we're going to bump the weight up. So increasing a little bit of the loading now. Take about 90 seconds to two minutes between your sets here. Woo. A little heavier. A little heavier with these guys. Leg day. You know it's hard. Got a little pre workout here. So, we're now entering the last week of the 30 day shred. For our shred athletes out there, they're doing amazing. Got one athlete in particular I'm really rooting for, Matthew Miller, who started last month at 275. And I believe after his second round through the shred, he's going to hit 235. So I'm pulling for him. I'm, he's my, my favorite because I know how far he's come. Just in 60 days, he's looking at dropping 40 pounds, which is outstanding. Also got some really, really great ladies in that group that have done big things. A lot of people in that 10 to 15 pound loss range um, and just a lot of work, a lot of, a lot of good hard work. So here we go. Set number two, going to trap in here, we're going for 15. Nice and slow. Good job, Isaac. That was a big kick. I'm dizzy. That's hard. Full power, Jonah. Full power. Whoa. That was a full power kick. Okay. So that was set two. Going to repeat. Same loading, same rep scheme. Set number three. We're still really taking our time in the negative. What I think about when I'm going down is I'm trying to feel my hamstring, especially my inner hamstring, stretch and load. Yeah. So. That's what I'm feeling there. A lot of, a lot of ascot going on. All right, here we go. Set three. Full power. Full power, Cammy. Cammy is a child. She is, she is literally like getting sucked into these games. She loves it so much. She just loves to play. I like your play. Full power. Full power. 
right, here we go. That'd be cool to have like a mantra, like before you lift heavy, you just go full power. Come on, Lipson, here we go. Full power. Oh yeah. Full power. No problem. Here we go. Ooh. power yeah that was hard a little hamstring a little glute there for sure so three one more set definitely got the backside loose here full power Gary Hold back. All right. I'm going to eat steak after this. I'm going to get some good steak and potatoes in me. Set number four. Same rep, same tempo, same weight. 15 with a three count. A nice stretch in your hamstrings. Get the band pulling extra, extra a little bit more on that hammy, too. Oh, gosh. All right. All right. Train that ass now. You got to train that ass, y'all. Woo! Oh. That's one best one. Hold power. Yeah. Uh oh. Very dizzy. Oh, I think it's a lot of slow tension on the way down. Good. All right. So now we're going to move to heel elevated squats. Squats, the squat zone. So you guys can see. Oh, that is a very elevated heel. Cool. I think it's gonna be good. Move you guys back a little. Back a little. Loosen this up a 
I'm just gonna use one dumbbell on these. Use that. No. No. I'll do it. So, I just have to go in back there. You okay, Jonah? I need to get the balloon, babe. Yeah. Okay. Did it pop the balloon? Right there. You get it? Yeah. What happened? I am not going in some rose bushes. Full power! Full power! Full power! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so first set is going to be 15. I have to go do some down. work, so just keep an eye on that. I got okay? him. Hey, you guys, don't die, okay? I got him, Cam. I got him. I got the kids. Nobody died. Nobody's allowed to die today. Hi. All right. Jonas, you did 20 rounds of the workout the other day. What about you, Isaac? You done? You going to go watch the floor is lava? No? I bet you are. I mean, the truth. But the floor is lava. Great show, by the way. Who are the brainiacs that thought that one up? Genius. The floor is lava. Are you an adult child? Do you like to pretend the floor is lava? Guilty. Well, now we have a show to ruin your life called The Floor is Lava. Where you can literally waste hours watching people and make believe land get eaten by fake lava. I think the floor is lava would have be much more exciting if you were on edibles because you would be so sad when someone got eaten by the lava. You'd be like, no, he was, he was just right here with me. I remember we went to lunch yesterday. All right, here we go. Squats. Floor is lava. Squats are lava. All of these kids, they're great. Very good kids. My sister did a good job. I would never tell her that, though, because I am her eternal antagonist. I am, I am the anti-hero to my sister. All right, so what's neat about this, I'm doing it on a single plate, is that uh, my feet are going to be kind of narrow, which is cool because uh, the narrower the stance, the more I'm going to get into my quads. I'm just going to feel the movement out the first set and try to get a good, healthy, smooth 15 and what smooth means to me is about two seconds down and two seconds up. So we'll just kind of get acclimated to the movement first. You ready, dumbbell? Me and you today, pal. It's me and you. Me and you, buddy. Oh, there we go. Floor's lava. I really like that movement. That is nice. It's a good elevation of the heel, too. A little breathe, a little breather. Take some breath a bit. I'm going to take about two minutes between the next set. So now we're going to get creative. And I'm going to have you guys do five half reps from the bottom. So five halves, three fulls five times through, which you're right, is a lot of reps. So one, two, three, four, five, 
One, two, three. Half, 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 half. Full, full, full. That's eight times five, so it's 40, 40 reps. So, yeah, I guess you could call it a lot more reps the second set. This will get pumpy. So I'm going to give myself a good rest before I get into this. I like warming up with the hamstring stuff too because I think for me it just gets the hips, the hamstrings, everything's already warm and primed before you start squatting. A little pre-fatigued even. So I think it's valuable to so doing some pre-fatigue sets before you start doing your more compound or heavier stuff. All right. Let's see if I can make it. Just thinking about this makes my legs feel like yellow. Both of them actually. Ay. Oh, come on, let's see. Look at happen. Look at happen, Captain. All right. No better day to die than today. Yep. There we go. That was really hard. Very, very hard. Oh. Yeah, was this? Oh. Oh, fuck you, said too. That's terrible. Belt off. It's the breathe I can Holy shit balls. So that was working partials. So partials from the bottom. So we're going to do three ultra slow reps. Five seconds down, three times. One, two, three, four, five.
time It's 10, ten seconds long, long, long set of nine seconds of With uh, uh, fifteen Better did do like this on I think this is Joe for Weekly, Right. 
Yeah. <laughs> 